Hey y'all, it's Tracy with Mama's Comfort Cooking, and today we're going to do cabbage. I've already started um, getting everything ready, so we're getting ready to fry steam some cabbage, okay? So what I'm going to do in this skillet right here, I'm going to take it off of me, but I'm going to tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to add a half a cup of canola oil into my skillet, and then I'm going to fry my fat back. I already have my cabbage over here. I just chopped it up, used the water that's on it, and I begin the steaming process. So let me turn it down so you can see what's about to take place. That's fat back, y'all. How is everybody's day going? Let's get this cabbage moving. While that fat back is cooking, I'm going to take the lid off of my cabbage that's steaming. Let me show you all this cabbage that I have. That's two heads of cabbage that I've just begun to steam off of its own. Don't talk about me, this is my food, okay? That's what my um that's what my people have been telling me. She stop apologizing. So I touched it with my hand, but it's my food and it's hot. Here we go. So that's the cabbage. And it's steaming on its own. So I'm going to add, I'm going to add half a cup to three-fourths of onion in this. Okay, so I'm going to sit it down and let you watch the fat back a little bit. And the cabbage at the same time. Uh-oh. Camera lady, get it together. I'm trying. I do not measure everything, but I'm giving you measurement. Just kind of work that onion down in there. I'm letting it steam off of its own natural juices in the beginning. I'm not adding anything. And I want you to see there's no water in here. It's just steaming itself right now, okay? There's an onion been added. Just the onion. But this is what's interesting. I'm going to add for mine. It is a fourth of a cup of sugar. Now this is two cabbage. You don't want to add that much with one cabbage. Let me get happy. I'm going to add one cup of chicken broth. You can use, if you are a vegan, you won't want to do the fat bag, but you can do the canola oil, and you can use vegetable oil. So let's put that in there. But I started sweating it. So that I would know that I would need as much juice because it was going to start doing it in its own juices. Let me measure the salt and pepper for you all that need the measurements because I just typically go in and do it my way. Let me get my measurement. One teaspoon, two teaspoons, three teaspoons, 
four teaspoons of salt. And two teaspoons of pepper. Four salt, two pepper. Once my oil and my fat back cooks to season the oil, the canola oil, this half a cup of canola oil, I'm going to pour it into the cabbage. As a matter of fact, I'm going to pour some of it right now and then keep letting it cook and make more oil for me. Left enough in there so it can keep frying. Can y'all see what I'm doing? I hope so. It's already doing its thing. And I can eat a crunchy cabbage as long as the flavor is right. Mmm. That's good. I'm going to cover it up. here. Let's see what you're saying to me today. Hey, Shanita Cooper. Hey, Doreen Harris and Joyce. Nevis. Kimberly Langston. It's going a little fast for me, so y'all bear with me. Hey, Lisa McClain. Is that right? Kim Langley Gott. I do not own the rights to the music that you hear in the background. I really don't even care if I use this fat back. I'm not going to put it in there. I just want the fat back to season my oil. This particular fat back here, I cut up myself. Now, if I was going to eat some, I would have bought it already sliced for me. And to be honest with you, I might cook this fat back one more time because I'm only seasoning my oil with it. Everything is going so fast, so let me get caught up. Hey, Barbara Williams. Hey, Lillian. Hey, Latasha. Amy Jones. Hey, Cheryl. No, Scott. Hey, Kim from Kentucky. Hey, Jane. Pa Patterson. Sometimes it's hard for me to see. Hey, Marlene Hall. I'm going to add some more oil to it. Hey, husband. Y'all want to see some pretty cornbread come out the oven? Let me show you how pretty my cornbread is. Hold on. Hold on. 
Hold on, let me get me some hand mittens. I'm getting it straight out the oven. This is before butter. Woo -wee. It's hot. Let's get that cornbread. Can you smell it? Oh, wow, it's good. Let me rub a little butter on there. Honey, did y'all get that message about Mondays? How we have to turn them into what we need them to be? Well, yesterday we ate leftovers, so I didn't have to cook anything. So today I said, well, let's cook something for the people. All right. Got that cornbread out the oven. Now, can I talk to y'all for a little bit? Let me let you see it. Y'all want to see how the cabbage is coming along? All right, let me let you see. Y'all get a good look of that. So it's steaming. Y'all, oh, what do y'all say? Y'all want to see what else I was having for dinner? Oh, I'll show you. I don't mind. I did some macaroni and uh, 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 cheese. I'm making you smile. Am I making y'all smile today? Because y'all have been making me smile. I thank you for your support. I thank you for your kind words. I thank you for your mean words. I just thank you. So I hope I'm making you smile today. Cover that up. Um, uh, do you want to see more of what we got going on today? Am I making you hungry, Yolanda Smith? Oh, I didn't want to do it, but y'all know what I say. I didn't want to do it, but I guess I gotta. I'll show you some more. Oh yeah, I got plenty to show you. So when we did the pulled pork, we did some ribs. Hey, Nita. And so I just incorporated a little sauce on the smoked ribs. Oh, did you want to see them close up too? Absolutely. Absolutely. I wouldn't do you that way. You want to see more? Okay, hold on. Let me put the ribs back down. Hold on. Hold one second. And I'll let you see some more. And I'll fix a plate for you if you want me to. And I'll take a bite for you. So, my chicken. And I'm going to take all that goodness and make a sauce. 
all that that you see that's left Ooh. those season perfectly oh yeah oh yeah oh yeah oh yeah I know what you're saying I'm saying the same thing mm -hmm. hold on yes I know I know I feel the same way I feel the same way so let me stir these cabbage for you real quick okay because I know you want to see the food so hold on Damn. Ooh -wee. Hold on. You see what I mean? Why you don't need a lot? You don't need a lot at all. I only use the broth for flavoring. It makes its own. Now I like crunchy cabbage. These are not quite ready yet, but if you like them crunchy, now's the time to probably stop them. These are crunchy right here. Mmm. Honey. Honey. You can say I don't like cabbage. Wait till you try these. These cook like your mama and your grandma. I don't want to add all that meat. I don't even have to have it. But the flavor has to be there. Lord help us. What did you say? What did you say, Cynthia? Pinky? Lord help us. Amen. Let the church say amen. <laughs> Tonight is all about the cabbage, baby, it is. Can you smell it? Hey, Alabama. Let me put the lid on it for a little bit. I don't want to lose any of the heat. All right, give me a second and I'm just going to chitter chat for you for about a good five minutes they're almost ready let's see who we got on here tonight is that all right do not inbox me and say we don't want to see you we want to see the food i am the food i'm the cook it's not right so give me a little love like i give you a little love hey sheila ashley from Carrollton. My daughter graduated from West Georgia University in Carrollton. My sister did. My sisters did. And my niece. Amen. It looks good, Nita. Cartersville is in the house. Hey, um, Estella Martez. I don't know what you wrote, Estella, but I'm sure it's positive. I don't speak Spanish. I wish I could though. I know um, um, Mi Casa has no loose because when I show houses, I know I have to let them know there's no power. Um, Cheryl Titcom, I can smell and taste it here in, in Iowa. Oh, yes, honey. Free R. Kelly today. I have nothing to do with that. Um, thumbs up. All right. Hey, from Ireland, Teresa. From Ireland and Latasha Murray from Chicago. And Cree Jones. I like your name. From Michigan. Ada is from Griffin, Georgia. Patricia Clark from Louisiana. BFF Forever Lottie. Lottie is in Atlanta. My friend Lois Parker 
Jacksonville is in the house. Indiana is in the house. That's Sandy Tally. And then we got Jules Adams from Missouri. Beverly Rowe from Georgia. Uh-oh, Georgia doing it for me. Yum Yum, Tiffany Thomas. Tammy Kelly is from Ohio. Oh, Southern Ohio. Southern Ohio. Now, I want y'all to stay with me now because I'm going to go and show you the end result. We're almost finished. It really doesn't take a long time to steam cabbage. Hey, Joyce Nevis. I'm not going to tell them Miss Joyce to get off because they're kings and queens. And sometimes we just have to develop to find out which one we want to be. And I don't want to be like that. And I don't want social media to turn me into something. I love to cook and I want to share it. So when, when I'm gone one day, y'all can look back and say, if they still got her videos up, that was a bad cabbage. That was some good shrimp. That was some good soup. I am. It is turning cold in Georgia. So I'm getting ready to make the um, short rib soup again. Short ribs are expensive. Yes, they are. But they're well worth it because the bone marrow has all this good, good, goodness in it. So it's easy to make it. Hey, Sheila Ashley. Uh, Lita Walker from Smyrna, Tennessee. Kim, Kim Langley got from Greenville, Kentucky. My husband went to school at Western Kentucky University in Bowling Green, and I think I told you that. I'm remembering your your name now. Hey, Marvin Thomas from Jackson, um, Tennessee. Hey, Lena Fuller, Misha Matthews, Rita McBride Thomas, Claudia Soper, Y'all know I can jack up some names. Hey, Marilyn Benham from Cartersville, I'm sure. Hey, Joyce, Artis, Tracia Jackson, Dorothea Wilson from Baltimore, Doris Peacock from North Carolina, Faith Scroggins from um, Baltimore, Mary E. Davis from America's Georgia. Isn't that where the school Southern Southern um, College or something like that is in America's? Estella Ola. Lindora Wiggins is from Virginia. Hey, my brother Philip is watching from London. I'm getting ready to put it back on there for you guys. I want to cook like my mom and my grandma. I'm sorry, y'all. I, I, I don't keep a lot of time and all that kind of stuff and extra stuff in. I, I, I want to pull the flavor out. But I want the flavor to be something that would be memorable. So when your children taste it, they'll say, hmm, something is missing. Hey, Jean Anderson from Alabama. Dina Malone from Oxford, Mississippi. Patricia Alexander from um, Enfield, Connecticut. And I do not know why Estella keeps writing me in Spanish. Can somebody tell Estella Martez that I can't speak Spanish? Uh, help me, Lord. Okay, let's see. We got Tawana Crawford from Memphis, Tennessee. Pamela um, Jurgens, like the lotion, is from Houston, Texas. First time. Hey, Pamela. Welcome, queen. Let's see who else we got on here. You want me to cook some mustard greens? Now, when I cook mustard greens, I mix them with something, Lois Parker. I don't just cook them by themselves. So, I guess I better turn it over. I don't want to lose my audience. Hey, Kim Board from Detroit. Lena Fuller. Um, Z um, Zandra. Clemens from Greensville, Florida. Rita McBride Thomas again from, I think I said your name before, I'm not sure, from Fort Myers. Okay, we've got Brenda um, Hart Griffin from Valdosta, Georgia. Shelly, love Jamie. I remember that. Shelly, I love my man too. You like my haircut? Well, I don't want to touch too much in there. Thank you. Laura Metz from um, Decatur, Alabama. How you say your last name, Phyllis, from Colorado, um, Colorado Springs, 
Terrence Rowe James is from Florida, Winston, Florida. Okay, y'all ready? That's good advice. Your salt and light stay lit, well seasoned. Okay. Oh, yes, I do smother um, beef short ribs all the time, Cree. And I do them over rice. And sometimes I will, um, I just do different things with it. But most of the time I do it with rice. And I do oxtails and all that good old stuff with um, with rice and peas. Hey, Connie from Milwaukee, Wisconsin. Oh, okay, Finesse, N Nevada. Is that my um, bouncing guy that I buy from? Um, Elise Johnson from Chicago, Tina Brown from Florida. Y'all ready to, for me to get back in there and show you what we're working with? Hey, Miss um, Carthesia Car Jeffries from Dallas, Texas. Y'all gonna talk about me and say she can jack up a night. <laughs> okay, I just I give up. I give up. You can't find short ribs in London. Are you telling me to mail some, brother, by any chance? You know, y'all eat small in London. Hey, Gwen from South Carolina with Georgia, South Carolina. Hey, Gaga Pri from California. Hey, Cousin Bo. Shireen George from California. Karen Hill from Memphis. Okay, y'all, let's go take a look at these. Let's go take a look and see what we got going on. How about that? Let's go check it out. That's all we're going to get to the good part. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. That's right. Hold on. I'm switching hands. Let's see me work. Remember, this is two cabbage. These are two cabbage. You see how that juice is almost out of these cabbage? Do you see what's going on? If you add too much, now some people like soup. Some people like to have this much juice. Look how pretty that juice is. You can drink that juice. y'all see what's going on? Do y'all see the goodness is taking a place in this kitchen? It is real. It's something serious. Okay, let's take another peek at this. And again, I say I can eat crunchy cabbage. I like a little bite to mine. But um, I'm trying to give you a good time of how long. This is two heads of cabbage. Two, two. Um, I mix my mustard greens, honey. I mix them with turnip greens. I have mixed all three. I mix cabbage and collards together. You'd be surprised who can get married and live good together. <laughs> Hold on. And I cook them on high. I cook them on high. So I'm gonna cover them up. I got about five more minutes, a good five. If you can bear with me for five minutes, five minutes, and they will be ready. <sighs> I got my um, dining room taper decorated for some of y'all that hadn't seen it. 
while I'm killing at five minutes. Let me show you my Christmas tree for those that have not seen it. Can you turn the choo-choo train on? I have a train that goes around my tree. There's a black, there's a black button at the front. You're gonna go, I'll let you, I'll move it on me. Go turn it on there for me. Turn it on. I'm gonna let you see my train go around the track. And then we're gonna let you see this one. Okay, we'll just turn this, turn one. this one. Okay, hold on, let me let you see my train. Well, it was supposed to go. She mashed it too hard. Uh-uh. <laughs> you mashed it too hard. Turn it off. I'm sorry about that. I'm sorry about that. It was just on accident. It was on accident. Daddy will fix it. Yeah. Now, here's my little Matthew. Uh-huh. Yep. And I'm going to see you. Okay. So we got about two more minutes. Two more minutes and we will be done with the cabbage. I have macaroni and cheese, cornbread, um, ribs, and baked chicken. With my chicken, I have all that goodness that's left from what I seasoned it. And I'll show you how to do that. Hold on one second. Um, one day when I do chicken and bake chicken where you realize that it cooks itself if you want it that golden color We'll do that as well. Let me talk to you just a few minutes. Merry Christmas Karen Hill Hey Vanessa um, Johnson Williams from Water Springs, Florida. I'm, I'm gonna think that's what it is You said Lois Parker mix the greens. I love them, but don't know how to cook them So I know they will be good can, does anybody on here have an Instapot? Anybody have an Instapot? Okay. I'm about to go. You know what? Uh, Cree, stop playing with me. Because I've been to Southern Fire. I um, Let me tell you this much. I do workshops with the Clark Sisters, with the Church of God in Christ. And when they have the Ames Convention... I stay downtown with the Fist, the Marriott, whichever one they pick for the music. And I've been to Detroit two or three times. And I have some friends that stay off of Seven Mile and Vassar. And I look at them as family. And honey, when I tell you Southern Fire, yes. Yes, they be kicking it. It is delicious. I have had theirs as well. I'm working with Dr. Um, Betty Nelson and so many people in the music department. I was I was fortunate to go and try it. It delicious, delicious. I love doing the Kojic workshops. Hey, Virginia. Hi. And Texas Tammy. Hey, Lisa Williams Sanders from North Carolina. Okay. Now, let me tell you about somebody said he healthy. I want to tell you, Lily and Oliver, if you want these to be vegan, don't season the canola oil. You can use, but I'm going to tell you a trick because canola oil is canola oil. So if I had not used that canola oil, like when I cook for my brothers that don't eat pork, I use a little cream of coconut with my canola to pull the fat and the flavor. Whereas with these, I used fat back, okay? All right, hey, Leon knows. Hey, Titus Kramer. Can I have a portion? That which I have, you can have. But I only cooked enough for me and my son. <laughs> Biblical, you can have. <laughs> because that means my pot is going to overflow. All right, let's get this going. I won't be before you so long. I see so many people on here. And I'll go back and read these later. Um, let's let you see it again. And let me sit it down. And I'm going to make a plate for you, okay? Hey, um, Janie Johnson uh, uh, Manis from Arkansas. Francis Hunt. Please, you all, comment, like, share, and follow my page. And comment down below. 
Oh, I know Super. Yes, Superintendent. Yes, William Ellison and Annie Koj. Uh, I grew up Kojic, and here my uh, bishop was Bishop Husband, and after him was the late Bishop Owens, who once was the presiding bishop of the Grand Old Church of God in Christ. Uh, grew up in the Grand Old Church of God in Christ. Um, I'm a Kojic baby, um, and I love to, you know, go to all the women's conventions the holy convocation and it was supposed to come back to memphis this year next year but anyway let me get ready for you all move avery i'll do it i do it okay thank you let me let you see we're at the end of this okay avery i'm gonna fix it for you Huh? That's full of healthy. Mm -hmm. You think that stuff is in there? Um, do me a favor. Mm -hmm. um, move over that way so I can get ready and show my stuff. Come here. Mm -hmm. This is my little girl Avery. Tell him hey. Hey. Tell him your name. Avery. Tell him how old you are. Eight. All right. Tell him bye. Bye. <laughs> Okay. Getting back to the food. Getting back to the food. That's right. Okay, we're done. We're done. It's done now. Yeah. What it shall be, it already is. It's done. Thank you, Jesus. God has worked it out on my behalf. Mine eyes may not see it, your mouth may not taste it. By faith, please receive it. It has manifest. It's already done. That's it. That is it. That's that. We're done. Woo! -hoo! We're done. Mom. Turn it off. Yep. Have you out for the all of your head? Thank you, Avery. That was really nice of you. <laughs> All right. I want to dip out and show you how it looks and show you a little bit of the macaroni and cheese. Hold on one second and let me plate. this macaroni cuts. Mm -hmm. Let me show you this macaroni. Avery, come hold this. What? Just like that. Mm -hmm. Come right here. You got it? Hold it. Get it. Hold it just like that. Can you hold it? Hold it like that. Hold it right there. Let me cut this macaroni for him. Hold it right there. Hold on. What? You said, what'd you say? What'd you say? Oh, I thought somebody said that macaroni was dry. What? What did you say? What? 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 <laughs> oh. <laughs> Wish for thinking. I thought somebody came, you know, came out for my macaroni and cheese, so I was just trying to make sure. Hold on, let me finish plating. All right. Is it still holding? No, I'm good. I got it. I got it, I got it, I got it, I got it. Oh, I want you to do it so well. Oh, I already ate my conscience. I know. Right? Mm -hmm. It smells so good. I'm going to eat that chicken. Sit it right here so they can be looking at it while I cut something else.
Hey, Louise. I'm, I'm good to go. Okay, I'm good to go. You don't have to wait. All right, let me show y'all what's for dinner. I just want you to take a peek. I don't wanna, I don't wanna bore you with it. But um, this is just the songs are birthed from my feelings. So let me just show you a picture. Hold on. I see us in the park under the shadow breeze of imaginings in my head and the words whispered from my heart told only to the wind Felt without even being said. Mm, I don't want to bore you with my troubles. But it's something about this food that makes me weak and knocks me off my feet. That's something about this food. <laughs> it makes me weak and it knocks me off my feet. Get that macaroni. Now I don't want to bore you with it. Ooh, but I love it. I love it. I love it. Get that cheese. I don't want to bore you with this. Mm. Mm. Lord help me. Ooh. Oh, did you say how tender was that rib? Somebody asked me that in the spirit. So in the spirit, this this is the rib. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You said, how golden is that chicken? Is that what you said? Mm -hmm. It's very golden. Mm-hmm. And it's not barbecue. Mm mm. No. Mm mm. Nope. 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 That cabbage. Yep. That's it. And that's that. Let me turn it around. And remember, do not throw away. See those um, little green lights giving me a party? Do not throw away your green around your cabbage. You just start cooking it a little earlier than the other, or you do like I said and start letting it steam itself first. Mm. Well, Annie Griffin, Tiffany Johnson, all of you 200 people, it's mm. good. It's real food. Mm -hmm. Take a bite of cornbread for somebody in the spirit. I will. Mm -hmm. Somebody said, um, Pam, focusing on me, you want brown, you said take a bite of what? Oh, this right here? Mm. I did it. So please, if you like what you see, please like my page, follow my page, share my page. The more 
Help me, Lord. We grow together. Bless it in Jesus' name. Every bite. I got carried away. But I cooked it in Jesus' name. But the more we grow together, the happier we'll be. Well, that's all I have for you all. I appreciate you for taking the time out of this Monday. I hope I made your Monday a little blissful. You pretty queens and you are handsome kings and your princesses and your prince. Remember, enjoy your life, enjoy your family, and enjoy your food. And until next time, I'll talk to you. Hey, Rosalind Shell Jones. Bye, y'all. Mama's Comfort Cooking. See y'all.